So these are just the standoffs used to mount glass and acrylic and different signage. And so I just got these plastic washers. You could use any kind of washers, but it is pretty important to glue something on the back of that washer, at least on one half, so you have some kind of leverage. Otherwise, when you tighten this down on the board, it's going to want to slip off. So my workbench is made out of wire shelving. And so I cut a piece of steel and put it underneath my ESD mat. So I'll show you. Yeah, so if you pull my mat back, just galvanil. So if you wanted to use these on some kind of plate, let's say you just got some steel, you might want to use these rubber half inch caps. That way you don't accidentally break your magnets because they're kind of fragile. So, but since the mat's already rubbery, I just decided to not use it. So another reason I like that I added the steel underneath the SD mat is that I use these type of dial indicator holders quite a bit. And you've seen them in a lot of my videos. You know, you can basically adjust them however you want and then you have it where you want. You can just one knob tightens all the joints up. But without something weighing it down, you know, if you're holding something kind of far away, it might want to tip. So because I have the steel underneath, now I can just use the magnet that's in the base that no matter where I am on my table, it's a pretty strong magnet. So put it off, once it comes down, but if I turn it on, it's not going to come down unless I really push it down. So, Alright guys, I hope you liked the video, and I'll see you next weekend.